now the second movement, con moto, which in Italian means with motorcycle. <laughs> means the Rockettes. of human inventions, both physically and psychologically, is the time bomb. <laughs> Guys have a weird sense of humor. <laughs> the mental tension and anguish of watching and waiting for that cataclysmic instant to occur is nearly as devastating as the bone-shattering explosion itself. Even so, a time bomb is exactly what I intend to juggle in this all-too-well-named terror trick. And speaking of time bombs, here it is. Thanks, Doc. Oh, look, it's important. From Modesto. <laughs> now, under this gold foil here is a protective restraining hood. Hey! There he is. <laughs> Once this hood is removed, this liter of luxurious liquid becomes a volatile live explosive. Imagine the crescendo of apoplectic anxiety as every shake, every toss, every slightest motion of this fizzling flask of frenetic fluid brings us closer and closer to that inevitable moment of truth. Imagine this innocuous cork turned by the irresistible pressure within to a hissing projectile. It's bullet-like fuselage of space-age plastic capable of wreaking savage destruction upon any part of my body so unfortunate as to find itself on the receiving end of this maniacal combination of Russian roulette and spin the bottle. <laughs> this bottle of champagne is terror object number nine. 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 Oh, not this way, please. Sorry. Boy, that was really close. Yeah. Aim towards the orange. Oh, okay. <laughs> Gentlemen, the prophylactic is off of terror object number nine. Oh, 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 come on. All right, you guys, terror object number eight. <laughs> well, you're all Catholics now. <laughs> we weren't actually going to use this for terror object number seven, but it managed to get the parts by way of a bit of pipe casting. <laughs> How come I always get these lines? <laughs> You wrote them. <laughs> Terror object number six. Meet Cleaver. Cleaver, audience. Audience. <laughs> <laughs> May 
Mesdames et Messieurs, cet objet de terre est objet numéro 5. <laughs> I knew you'd be impressed if I spoke Italian. This traditional Mediterranean castration instrument is color object number four. Color object number three. No joke. Not funny. <laughs> I could be wrong. Duh. 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 <laughs> this is the very skillet which inspired Shakespeare to cook up his most famous of plays, Omelette Pans of Denmark. <laughs> back, back in your cage. What'd you say? My mother wrote that joke and I like it. <laughs> and it's also terror object number one. Razor sharp. Terror object number zero. Clint, 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 Clint. Oh, my eyes. An old San Franciscan tradition. <laughs> oh, look closely, ladies and gentlemen. Could be the last thing you see. You know, it's a funny thing. In your normal theatrical context, your front row seats are your best seats. <laughs> Hold on to your toes. Can you say bye-bye? <laughs> Don't do it! Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Why? We didn't even invite her. She wouldn't have come anyway. <laughs> oh. Okay. 